Hi there Sagittarius, this is your January 2020 Love Monthly Forecast Reading with me Chrissy from In The Stars by Chrissy.com Now, before anything else, I just want to apologize to you guys because the last four signs of the zodiac is actually having this um, mid-month forecast for January because you know um, I've been having a lot of difficulties in terms of my computer connection it's been taking a whole lot of time to upload the January forecast also I also got sick and if you have seen my earlier videos you will know that my voice isn't um, looking so well and I'm coughing here and there throughout those readings so please do bear with me with that I will make it up to you guys on February though so stay tuned for that um, but um, yeah this is your general reading for January or your myth month reading for January please do know that it may or may not resonate and tune in to each and every one of you guys but um, yeah please do use your own intuition um, to navigate on what the message could be telling you at this time so Sagittarius for January what I'm getting here is I kind of feel that a lot of you guys are in the face of reflection like you could be looking back with your life which is very ironic because Sagittarius is a sign that tends to look forward for the future but the thing that I'm getting here is that there is some form of pause happening here or you might be feeling the sense that things are moving slow in your life even if when you are already at the stage where in you want to do something you want to get things going i just kind of feel that you know everything is at a red light right now where in you are being forced to stop or you're questioning a lot of things in your life like where do i really want um to be in in the future what type of relationship you know it doesn't have to be always a relationship in terms of the opposite sex this could be with you in general not just with your marriage not just with your relationship but with you as a whole as a person as an individual are you happy you are questioning a lot of things in your life and maybe you do want to create changes in your life but i just kind of feel that right now even though i do see that things are going to be to be moving forward in your life it's just that for january that is probably not the case i don't see a lot of movement like literal action happening here but it's more of everything could be at the pause everything is all in your head and i do see that you are being sensitive right now i kind of feel that you are you might be getting a lot of psychic downloads all at the same time we do have a lot of cards here that promote some form of intuition and knowledge so you might be you know finding out a few things here and there or for some of you guys it's going to be for a little part of sagittarius i kind of feel that for some of you guys you are desiring change because you are starting to get bored with the things that are happening in your life so it is as if you are preparing your engine you are about to move forward into something but at the same time you are still you know making some form of preparations thinking about things evaluating things you are really focused on that we do see here that you know um you are about i kind of feel that for some of you guys you are already making the changes there are actions that you are already implementing 
very subtle though i kind of feel that you are making subtle changes maybe you know you are initiating things in terms of a relationship you are speaking out more taking action more i mean this could be this will vary depending on what type of relationship you have right now if you're single you are at a point wherein you're starting to communicate or you have you are having this urge of wanting to talk to people wanting to communicate with people wanting to date someone i kind of feel that relationship is actually in your mind well your whole life is in your mind but i kind of feel that you are starting to you're starting to show like show the world or acknowledge the fact that you need love that you need a relationship especially if you are a sagittarius who has who doesn't really care so much about relationships a sagittarius who is you know it's not that they don't care it's just that it's not their priority but for some reason for the month of january i kind of feel that there could be some form of sensual energy in the surface of things and there is a form of emotional feeling or, or melancholy wherein you kind of feel you kind of miss the, the feeling and energy of being with someone or really being in you know intimate with someone or having that foundation of a relationship with someone there are desires that i am picking up here even though that you know i really don't see anything concrete so this could be for those that are single and they are wanting a relationship it seems they want to start a new beginning of some kind and i kind of feel that you know even though that for some of you you are not taking any action you might spend a lot of time thinking thinking of your own desires what do you want and that is why i kind of feel that a lot of you guys are going to be susceptible to temptations because as the month progress you will come into terms of how much you are longing for something how much you are longing for someone this could be a person this could be a connection with someone or this could be just you know um this could just be telling us that you will spend a lot of time with your partner or a, a, a date potentially and wanting to move closer to that person step by step there is some form of you know coming together that you want to happen and manifest in the world i just kind of feel though that this is not really about this is not really about talking to someone and getting closer with them i just kind of feel that the energy has a lot to do with your desires what makes you happy what fulfills your urges right now that is really what's in focus what satisfies you at this time is the most important thing it may be a, a relationship it may not be a relationship you know but it can be something physical i kind of feel that you know it is it gives you a sense of pleasure i mean it could be sex it could be something else i just kind of feel that you know you feel that something is lacking in your life and you want to um to fill in that void to give a sense of happier feeling to yourself i also kind of feel that you know a lot of you guys are sensing that something is about to happen in my life but for some reason things are not happening there is no action and i want to have some form of action so 
for some of you guys, you are having a hard time controlling this energies, controlling all of these emotions that you are feeling and sensing in the world. So there is that kind of energy as well so there is an energy here wherein you might be going all over the place as a possibility on this because i just kind of feel that a lot of things are happening all in your head like you know you may not be thinking anything but it feels as if words are on your head and it is overwhelming you which is which can be difficult in terms of talking about real life situation because it feels as if you have a lot of plans in your life you have a lot of things that you want to happen but for some reason you're not able to take action on that you're not able to implement anything you know your plans are put on hold and not because not because of other circumstances i mean it might be but i just kind of feel you are unable to to take the action yourself so there is a sense here wherein there is some form of conflict wherein you wanted for things to move forward but things are just not moving forward as you are desiring it to be i just kind of feel though that january is going to be a time of reflection not just for you but for a lot of people really but i just kind of feel that this will make you realize more on this will certify i guess certify probably is the word i should be using to make you sure of your desires because i kind of feel that maybe in the past you have been wanting things and then when, whenever you get it, it slips away from you or you become doubtful if you actually want that thing or person or relationship in your life. So it becomes a, a very unhealthy thing, unhealthy cycle in your whole system, in your relationships with people as well. You know, you're not just damaging things in your life but you're damaging the life of the other person involved as well whether it is intentional or not intentional so i kind of feel that things for january for you is going to be slow like you feel like you want for things to move forward but you're just not seeing it happening and maybe a part of you are losing hope uncertain things and a part of you are hopeful and not hopeful like there's so much indecisive energy that i'm picking up in your in your field in this reading it's like yes i want this i want that but there's always a sense of but but it's complicated or it's not as easy as you think you know it's not as if working hard will solve everything there is a lot more than that i just keep getting that message all over this reading and i kind of feel that the energy here is it's like, it's like there is something happening in terms of your love life and relationships that helps you to become sure of something you know i don't know what thing that could be but it is your focus whatever that you want whatever it is that you want that you have always been indecisive with um, the universe god or the energy in place for january is going to make you be more sure if you want it or you don't want it or if it's for you or not for you so you will come into terms by the end of january by really um becoming sure of what you truly feel and what you truly want not something that you just invented by the whim not something that you like or don't like because you got triggered emotionally 
by emotional reaction through someone else because that is possible sometimes especially when our ego are is being you know hit <laughs> is being targeted we tend to react on things those kinds of stuff so yeah this is going to give us an increase of something increase of desires coming into place so to be honest i really don't see anything special other than that for sagittarius oddly enough it's like there's a lot of complexities happening for you right now and a lot of realization but at the same time it kind of feels as if it's all it's all like it feels life threatening to you it's like for you this is serious but if you take it another another aspect if you look into your own situation on another aspect it it also feels not that serious but at the same time it's very serious to you so i kind of feel that you know this is this can be very psychological reading for sagittarius and it has a lot to do with the things that you want in your life you, what you want to manifest what you really really want and it really brings out that complex nature of how you are handling relationships the things that you don't want and you don't want and i kind of feel that you know faith and destiny is being triggered right here this getting this type of reading for january clearly tells me that something is about to happen for you definitely something is going to change your faith change your destiny and it's going to stick to you throughout the year but for now the idea here is that for you to really know what you want because a lot of you i get I kind of feel that maybe you don't know what you want or maybe you tend to have a cold feet on things like maybe you wanted to marry someone and then suddenly you lose interest and right now it feels as if everything is is slow or things may be lacking so your mind might be going in haywire like you're thinking of one thing over another and you're not really sure what path you should be following at this time as i speak right now sometimes i get overwhelmed with the energies as well since i feel them and expressing them to you sometimes i talk and talk and at the end of the day i don't even know what i'm saying <laughs> it it get it gives me that kind of energy it's like i feel like i have an intention to why i'm saying this in this video but at the end of the day it makes me feel that okay in summary what i mean to say is i don't know there is that kind of feeling and energy because this is really more of uh you know some form of desires that you are feeling so all i can say is that you might be spending a lot of your time for january in following your own wishes and desires and feeling them and acknowledging them and this time once you are sure of what you want you will be able to able to pursue it and hopefully you will be able to and hopefully it's not too late and hopefully that this time around you're not gonna change your mind and hopefully there is no regrets in place because i kind of feel that at the end of the day what you will find out is that you are going to want something so much that you are willing to do everything that you can to get that in your life to attain that to own that to possess that it can be quite like a scorpio energy though but i kind of feel that there is some form of aggression that 
you are going to undertake in the future not for january though i kind of feel that it's very odd really i really don't see much action but more on the idea of of you wanting things to go and move forward it's like you're planning for something but you're not necessarily taking the action right at this moment so i kind of feel that this is more about you um taking a look on everything that's in your life what is worth it and what is not but you know regardless of what is really worth it this is really more on what do you want what makes you happy it's all about you and for some people that could be a selfish nature but i kind of feel that you know sometimes that is what is lacking in our life to pursue our own agenda our own desires our own goals because we do have our own goals you know regardless of how much other people want to stay humble and all that at the end of the day we all have our own wishes and own goals and we want to make them happen and sometimes to be happy to attain happiness you need to take action based not on what other people are telling or expecting of you but based on what is true for yourself and being oddly enough we do have the sun here in the sign of gemini in the second house and i keep talking about possession ownership and all those kind of stuff so this can be you know um sun and gemini has that nature of wanting one thing over another those kinds of things being indecisive can be in place basically everything that i mentioned uh, is being signified by this astro dice that i have over here so that was very ironic because i did not plan to say that at all so um yeah let me see what advice card is coming up for you sagittarius for january 2020 okay we have here the card of the trust i can feel that this is telling us that you know at the end of the day it's telling you that you might be thinking of one thing over the other but nothing is really going to ever happen if you don't take action and do it and i kind of feel that for a lot of you guys maybe you are repeating a cycle but this time around it's like doing something all over again but doing it a little bit different like going back into something doing something as if you are repeating it but you're going to do it with a different mindset on things and i kind of feel that a lot of you guys are hesitant on that because maybe you feel that you know this is not worth it this is going to be just a unhealthy cycle all over again no there is no future in this those kinds of things but I kind of feel that you know regardless how complex your situation is at this time just focus on what you want and work on that and trust the process that you know eventually your actions will lead you to some form of truth and right now what is in your head is not really important but what is in your heart is very important that kind of thing so allow this energy to unfold give in to your impulses in life may it be through lust physical nature emotional or psychological nature like give in release don't control yourself too much and give in to what you truly 
feel like your own nature that kind of energy so and trust the process and know that things are eventually going to work out so i kind of feel that this gives you a sense of hope and positivity in things i really don't know what is the main focus energy for sagittarius since this is a very somehow a vague process for me i kind of it kind of feels vague because it can be anything it can be anything that you are in concern with but regardless of what topic or concern or situation or relationship setup you have at this time it's telling you to trust the process and to give in to what is really in your heart so um yeah this is my reading for you guys i kind of feel that your action occurs not on january but on the following months maybe but um yeah this is all about real re realization of your own feelings and true feelings for maybe in relation to yourself or the situation that you're in or in a relationship or with a particular person that is special in your life so um yeah this is it my reading for you guys sagittarius sun moon and rising sign for january 2020 and i shall see you again on february